Now, we go out and share this, the concept of three, telling three, telling three, telling three. A little bit like John and John's paycheck. John, when he first started telling me about Weora, was making no money. Fifteen months later, was making about ten grand a month. Well, John's checks are significantly higher today. Well, if we doubled, if we had a penny in our pocket, which I don't right now, but if we had a penny and we doubled a penny for 30 days, this is what happens, folks. Now, Amanda, I'm not going to pick on you, but you're in the front row and I'm going to ask you the question, okay? If you doubled a penny for 30 days, what do you think in 30 days it would be worth? Mm, I'm going to guess high. Guess high. This is a microphone. 1.2 million pennies. 1.2 million dollars. 1.2 million dollars. That's a good guess. Robbie, met you in the bathroom, didn't I, a little while ago? What do you think a penny's worth? How old are you, Robbie? About 12? 11. You're 11. My son's 13, and I had him figure this out on his calculator cell phone. You know, we pay for him every month. What do you think if we doubled a penny for 30 days, what do you think that number would be? $1,000. That's a good guess. The penny's worth $5.3 million. Whoa. Amanda was close. Robbie was close. $5.3 million. Now, it's October, right? There's 31 days in October. What happens in October? It's worth not Halloween. Don't worry about Halloween, man. It's worth... $10.6 million. That's the same, that's what happens here, ladies and gentlemen. Imagine you enrolled me. And I went out and I started sharing this like I shared it when we first started, and I continue to share it today. Imagine the percentages you earn on my organization that does close to $2 million a month in business. If you enrolled myself, that's a lot of money paid back to each and every one of you. Now think about this. There's a ton of other people out there that are going to earn more money than I am in Wayora. They haven't been found yet. They're looking. Remember all the people looking for something? They're looking. Well, that same scenario is three telling three, down here on the ninth level, about 20,000 people purchasing a hundred or so dollars in product. And, and actually it's laid out here in this report, anybody afterwards that would want to see this, it's 83 or 82 pages of, of orders, some of them as low as ten dollars, some of them as high as two or three thousand dollars, and on those orders that happen in 11 countries around the world, the company sends my wife and I a check every month. That's residual. We've also got a Ruby bonus pool. Extra $550 last month if you made the Ruby bonus pool. As Ruby, it actually doubled the Ruby's commissions. An Emerald bonus pool. Many people actually around the country qualify for that. Yours truly, the Deckers qualify for that on a regular basis, the Emerald Bonus Pool, the 2% Diamond Bonus Pool. Here's a slide that I want you to pay close attention to, this next one. Our average earnings for 2007. Remember when I started the, the actual meeting and I asked, how many would love to make that extra $5,000 a month? Well, what would you do with that $5,000? Our average ruby, now this is average, about 9,300. Average emerald at about 45,000 per year. That's right there at that 5,000 or close to it per month. Our average diamond, about $196,000. There's about 25 diamonds or higher in the company. Single diamonds, almost 300. Double diamonds, almost 625. 
triple diamonds, 1.15 million. Now, these are small numbers. In five years, these are going to be magnified because our company in five years will be doing not just $4 million a month, but 30 and $40 million a month. Think about that. That's what's happening. Now, John, when John first shared this with me, his checks were right at that 10K marker. John, because of a great line of product and some just a couple of people going and sharing it, John's checks are about one, about 110 to 115 per month. It's 110 to 115 thousand dollars a month. Now this is a man who used to make 22 thousand dollars a year as a maintenance man at a potato chip factory. He's got a learning disability as well that he's had to deal with still deals with it. It's called dyslexia. Does not a spell that well. If you saw his handwriting, you'd maybe think it was a third grader writing the, the message, literally. But he can earn $1.3, $1.4 million. How does that happen? Some people work really, really hard and they make 50 grand a year. John figured it out. I'm here as an ambassador for John to help you all figure it out. That's what I'm here for. Several in the room, raise the hands. How many are actually earning checks and have made money with the company? Look around you. Keep your hands up if you wouldn't mind. If you're a guest in the room, for sure, look around. About 55, 60% of the hands have gone up. The company pays. They pay on time. They pay regularly every couple weeks. There's going to be some people right here in the local economy and area that have it in their hearts to share this with enough people where they're going to turn around in two and three and four and five years from now, earn that 40, that 50, that 70, that $100,000 monthly figure. But it starts tonight. You're going to leave here in a little bit and you're going to make a couple decisions. I think I like what I saw. I, I want to get started. I want to get started right away. I know I like what I saw. I want to get started. That's one decision you're going to make. The other decision, now nah, you know, this really isn't for me. And if you're a guest tonight and you're thinking this isn't for you, the person who's brought you here tonight, Share with them someone you know that may have an interest. You see, the Deckers were just acquaintances many years ago. They sent me something out of the blue, an audio message, and I listened to it and responded to that. I didn't know them from Tom's house cat. Turned around and, and, and became friends with them and they made a lot of money on my efforts, and I figured it was time I returned the favor. <laughs> now, you've got people you know that need this. You need to share this with them. That's the key here. You're leaving here tonight. Is the fire in you to go share it much more passionately, or is the fire in you to let other people go and do that? See, for me... I'm about helping people. And as an electrician, I can't help many. 